find the complement of the following functions. Here two functions are given. We need to find the complement of those functions and we have to draw the circuit using basic gates. Let me consider the first function that is f1 is equal to we have x bar y z bar plus x bar y bar z. This is the given function. We need to find the complement. So take complement on both side. That is f1 bar is equal to we have x bar y z bar plus x bar y bar z take complement. Now let me simplify this. So here I can apply De Morgan's theorem. I'll consider this as one term and this as another term. So by applying De Morgan's theorem, I can write it as x bar y z bar whole bar dot we have x bar y bar z whole bar. Now again for this function, for this term, I can apply De Morgan's theorem. So I can write x bar bar plus y complement plus z complement of complement. So this is first term. Again here I can apply De Morgan's theorem. So I can write x complement complement plus y bar bar plus z bar. Let me simplify this. So x complement of complement is x itself plus y bar plus z and here we have x plus y plus z bar. So this is the complement of the given function. Now let me draw the circuit using basic gates. So for this we need one OR gate. So let me take one OR gate, 3 input OR gate. So one input is x this is x we have y bar so this is y pass through inverter and this is y bar and here we have z so this is the first term now let me draw this so again i'll take one more three input or gate this is x this is y and we have z bar that is z pass through inverter and this is x plus y plus z bar here it is x plus y bar plus z here it is x plus y plus z bar so now we have to connect these two using and gate use and gate here the output of this is connected here and output of this is connected here the output of and gate is f1 bar so this is the circuit diagram for the given function now let me consider the second function which is f2 is equal to we have x y bar z bar plus y z plus y z let me take complement on both sides. So I can write f2 bar is equal to we have x y bar z bar plus y z whole bar. So here I will apply De Morgan's theorem. This is x dot this term. So I can write x bar plus this entire term that is y bar z bar plus y z whole bar further i will simplify this this is x bar plus so again here i will apply de morgan's theorem i can write y bar z bar whole bar dot y z whole bar let me simplify that is x bar plus so here i can again apply de morgan's theorem here i can write y bar bar plus z bar bar this is first term and here i can apply de morgan's theorem y bar plus z bar or i can write it as x bar plus so this is nothing but y plus z and this is nothing but y bar plus z bar this is 
f2 bar now let me draw the circuit for this x bar let me take inverter this is x here we got x bar here we have y plus z i'll take one or gate we have or gate the input is one input is y another input is z so output of this is y plus z here we have y bar plus z bar let me take one more or gate y bar means take the inverter so here we have y this is y bar take one more not gate this is z here we have z bar it is connected to or gate so between these two terms there is a and gate we need one and gate let me take the and gate this is one input and this is another input now output of this and this that is this entire term with x bar we need an or gate take one or gate so output of this is connected here and this x bar is connected here so output of this is nothing but f2 bar so this is the circuit diagram for second function thank you for watching